dear guys, oh dear is all I can say. Shoot, pass, anything, you didn't do anything. Spurs, what are you doing? Tottenham, my beloved Tottenham. And yeah, this vlog is going to be different, but the way the games have gone recently, this is how the vlog is going, basically. Um, this is so annoying. Like, what are we doing, losing all these games? Now, I've got a vlog from last week's game against Southampton, which is the last game we won. Um, and then it all went to pot from there. So it all went down. Oh, Mass is here. Hey, hey, hey. Little bros here. So I'm gonna have to. I don't have to do anything. You've got the key. Uh, but yeah, guys. Spurs, what are you doing? Jesus. Come on. I mean, none of the players just want to want to be there. No, guys. I mean, that defence is just. What's happened? We're the same players, but it's just a bit messed up in that dressing room. I think. Ericsson has to go. Uh, I don't know. Kane is dropping too deep. All these problems are occurring. Maurice is now injured after the, the Brighton game, but I'll get onto that in a minute. Because what were we doing losing 7 2 to Bayern Munich? I was at the game, and yeah, I was going to vlog, but obviously, no point because it's just a waste of time that game, unless you're a Bayern Munich fan. Um, but yeah, 7 2. It's just ridiculous. We can see like 10 goals in like, two games. Obviously, Bayern Munich is Bayern Munich. But you don't want to lose. I, I, I said before the game, and I'm, I know my team, I, you know, I was like, we're going to lose. But I thought maybe 2-1, 3-1, you know, we'll put a good show in. We did first half, it started that way. And half time we were losing 2-1. And just went downhill from there. They turned the screw. They got so much better than we did. And yeah, I didn't vlog that because I was just not in the mood. And yeah, that didn't go well at all. I wasn't at the Brighton game, obviously that was in Brighton. But normally you go to Brighton for the beach. Not to get battered 3-0. And have your goalkeeper almost break his arm. Like the Reese is out forever now, for ages now. Might as well be forever, you know what I mean? And I'm just seeing like all, the, all these rumours about Poch moving on, all these Madrid rumours, like he might be going to Madrid. If he does, he'll probably take some Spurs players with him, like Ericsson or Kane or whatever else. And like Kane, that's a tough one. There's a few debates about it, like has he got the, I don't know, the uh, motivation anymore? Because he's not as good as he was two years ago. He's supposed to be progressing as a player. He's dropping deep, you know, he's... I don't know. He's getting the goals, but like... I, I, I hate to say it, he, you know. We, we've got to move on some players. I mean, had we won the Champions League, they would have moved on anyway. Um, that was like the... The culmination of everything. Like, that would have been what these players were working towards. And then you didn't win it. Fine. Move on. Get new players. Maybe it's time for a new manager, as much as Poch has been a legend. And he's t where he's taken us from to where we've got to, from where we are, you know, it's, it's amazing. We had Tim Sherwood before that, you know. Um, but yeah, I guess the future of Spurs is getting Crouch out of retirement, Redknapp back in charge, Nico Cranchar in the midfield, you know. Ledley King out of retirement. <laughs> nah. I just don't, I don't know what's going on. I don't have an explanation, I don't know, it's just one of them things, like a like rubber band effect, you know, getting so high and then bang, your elastic band breaks, and then you're back to square one. But at least it's not as bad as United's problems, which are relegation, relegation, that's their problem. I mean, losing to Newcastle, come on. But yeah, I can't really talk about that, can I? Because Spurs aren't doing too well at the moment, our form is like losing every other game. But yeah, I'm going to leave you with the Southampton vlog that I did, not really a vlog, it's a bit of it. Um, because I tried to upload it from my 11 Pro, but it just didn't work on my laptop for some reason. I guess because it's not a Mac. But there you go. Uh, I've had so many family members over, it's crazy. I've got a friend that's just come over from Italy, so things are really hectic around here. I've been so busy, I haven't had time to edit or even vlog. I've got a vlog from the NFL game I went to coming up soon. Raiders v Chicago Bears from Sunday. Um, you're gonna love that because that was amazing at 
at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. You know, seeing a win was nice. Because <laughs> with Spurs, there's not many of them at the moment. Um, but yeah, that is it for this little rant about Spurs. I don't do this too often because it doesn't happen that often. But yeah, when you support a football team, winning and losing is part of it, you know. Um, there's got to be good times and bad times. But that is it at the moment, guys. Thank you, guys. Come on the Spurs, anyway. Alright guys, it's still 2-1, we're out here, I don't like this Southampton away kit, it's so weird, it looks like Pittsburgh Steelers, NFL team, but yeah, what a mistake, can't believe Maurice, what is going on with Spurs, everyone's been a bit harsh on the manager, but let's get this, come on Soninho, Sonalo, yes, and Dombele, Son, well they can't attack, Guys, I'm not looking at the bloody viewfinder, am I? Come on! Yeah, clear it. Yes, Danny Rose. The man, the myth, the legend. Danny Rose. Gonna get his ball back. Score again. Come on, Spurs. Clear it, Suzoko. Yes, win it. Go on, Winksy. We're not getting this ball at the moment. It's all Southampton at the moment. It's that Redmond you've got to be careful of. Come on, you Spurs. Come on, you Spurs. Win it then. Yes, tackle them. Come on, boys. Mads, wake up. Talk them. Talk them. We made a save. Hugo actually made the save. 